I did have an issue in my group therapy sessions with a couple of, uh, of the members in my group therapy. Um, they were in different branches. Uh, they weren't on the front lines like I was. They were in the rear with the gear. And, you know, they, they saw stuff, but the stuff they saw was injured, you know, injured Marines, injured, you know, Army personnel. Um, they weren't actually affected themselves. And, and, and I would get mad, you know, when, when they're telling their story. And, and, and here I am. I mean, I'm telling my story. And, you know, I was, I was in a Humvee that, that was hit by a rocket propel grenade. And I took an AK round into the foot. And, and, and I'm telling mine. And I'm like, man, you know, I was like, you guys are here, and I don't feel like you need to be in the same group as me. I mean, you, I, I mean, I bled, and and you didn't, and uh, I mean, I was fighting every night, and you didn't. I've come to realize that it's you need all kinds of uh, of different wheels to make the machine run, and it's not just the the infantry that that deserves the. I guess the group therapy sessions or the help, it's, it's everybody. I mean, even if you just saw somebody injured, that can stick with you. I mean, it's, it's another American that is just another brother or sister to you that, that was injured. And um, that, I mean, that would stick with, I, now that I look back on it, that would stick with me if I saw another one of my, my brothers or sisters, you know, go down. The PTSD clinic is for everybody. It's, it's not just for, you know, infantry or, you know, that's for everybody.